it's been a while since I did a spawn review and I haven't been doing spawn because I've been pretty much focusing on Iron Man and let's plays and shit like that but uh yeah why not get started on spawn issue 26 so the comic book opens up where we see a woman pretty much get taken away because a man couldn't support her and this old man wants her daughter back and let's just say the law doesn't help everyone Meanwhile, we go back to hell, and we see my Bulja, and he's talking to all his fucking demons and shit like that, and he's talking about the hell spawns, and we go back to spawn Al Simmons, and he's just wondering what the hell he needs to do until he meets somebody. Kaliosa? I can't even say his name right. Anyway... He talks to Spawn and he tells him that you're just learning things that you're witnessing for the very first time and we see Mabulja and everything between on that and they, they start talking and they pretty much talk about mortals having basically evil in their heart and Al Simmons pretty much say, then why the fuck do I'm sent here? If this all is just a test, and pretty much, he, the old man, as I like to call him, pretty much says, Yeah, um, you were here because you made a deal with one of the devils, and the devils are pretty much one of many, besides Lucifer, and pretty much, you didn't read the print of the contract. <laughs> That's really the nutshell out of them all. And then he meets up with two other people, and he meets this woman who's, I'm assuming, Angela's boss. Um, correct me if I'm wrong, but um, that would be helpful. But anyway, um, they asked Spawn, do you know about Angela? And he says, oh yeah, I know her. She tried to fucking kill me. And then pretty much he answers their questions, and pretty much they leave. And the old man and Spawn pretty much talk and he says, is this some kind of fucking sick joke? Was that heaven? And he tells Spawn that no, it's pretty much something a little different. It's something that people don't really know. And it, it's what, he, what I'm trying to say is what the old man is pretty much saying is it's something that us mortals we weren't taught about that's really what i was pretty much getting out of this issue but anyway we also get a little bit of a flashback where clown was beating the shit out of spawn and then pretty much we also get to see other fucking hunky dory shit that really i was kind of raising an eyebrow when tom mcfarland was writing this shit we also see spawn pretty much just sitting there reading a newspaper and pretty much at the ending of the comic, we just pretty much see him just at the corner, just doing this beautiful panel, which is absolutely gorgeous. And we go back to where my bull job is, and he tells his story of how his hell spawn and everything between on that. And I absolutely love these panels. These panels to where we get to know Malbolja and how he's menacing, how much he's a very threatening villain behind the scenes and one of the devils in hell and everything between on that. Very good issue, very good writing. There were, I'm gonna say this right now, this is not the best writing from Tom McFarlane. McFarlane has good writing stuff on his books of Spawn. It's just his early shit pretty much is, really, you came up with this crap? I mean, come on, I, I think we could have done a little bit more, but I mean, it's a good issue, and uh, I'm gonna give it an 8 out of 10. Good issue, looking forward to doing the next issue. Sorry for the delay. I've been busy with Iron Man, and uh, yeah, stay tuned for more Spawn reviews. And other comic book reviews that I'm going to be doing. And Let's Plays like Darksiders 2, Darksiders 1, uh, Assassin's Creed, and also Injustice 1 and 2, Mortal Kombat 10 and 11. And uh, yeah, I I'm going to be doing a lot of good stuff. Hopefully you guys 
come aboard. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Stay tuned for more videos and peace. Stay tuned and see ya.